With the process set to return to action soon as Australia prepares to arrive on South African soil, fast bowler Kakiso Rabada has been using his free time constructively. Nine years after making his process debut, the 28-year-old is looking to unearth the next batch of sim bowlers who will take the country's cricket to the next level. Newsroom Africa's Yolu Lekoshe has more. Young aspiring fast bowlers from every walk of life gathered at the Wanderers Stadium to learn a thing or two from one of the best in pro tier, Kakiso Rabada. One of the youngsters was Caden Dunker, a left arm seam bowler. Bowling fast, taking lots of wickets, seeing the stump mainly fly off the ground is a massive impact for me. Seeing batters duck around, it's just, it really inspires me to try and get bigger, to bowl fast and to just one day to be like them. Dunker, who is also at Rabada's former school St. Stidians, says their similar paths in cricket development are already serving as motivation. Just being in the atmosphere where they were, being in the same classrooms, raises cricket awareness for me. Um, it really inspires me as a person to be just like him because he walked the same steps. I'm walking to my journey, my end goal. Um, at Saints, we just concentrate a lot on our cricket development and our talents and um, really, really grateful to be there. On the other side of the spectrum is Koke Somnube from Alexandra Township. He admits that there is no cricket at his school and fell in love with the sport after watching it on TV. He says being at the Rabada Fast Bowling Academy has boosted his confidence. I usually doubt myself but then today I gain more confidence because I heard someone calling my name so I was like okay I can do this, let me just do it then I did it. Everyone started calling my name, everyone started calling me, come here, do that and stuff. That's where I started gaining confidence. Because I'm someone who is lacking with confidence, but then today I've gained more. Nube also shares some encouraging advice he received from Rabada. He said I can be one of the best, I'm much quicker in my age group. So if I can work more, I can be like him and my role model, which is Jofra Acha. It was not just the boys, but girls too, who were benefiting from Rabada's expertise. One of those girls was Nosipiwe Mashele, a 15-year-old from Soweto, who learned the game at the Dobsonville Cricket Club. I'll have to learn new things from him. Yeah, maybe there were a few stuff that I didn't know, so I think I already know now. And I see over like they are trying to get me to bow in the right way, rather than doing my own stuff, yeah. For young Katle Komzobe, it was even hard to sleep, knowing that he will be benefiting from his role model's knowledge of the game the next day. the opportunity to be here. And so, to so yeah. Zobe says he had met Rabada before and recalls their interaction. Yeah, Rabada confirms the selection criteria for these young bowlers. Once we identify those players, we bring them in and hone their skills. And with our close relation with uh, CGL, um, perhaps. You know, it's right at the doorstep. Uh, if, if, if talent is, is uh, unearthed, then you know, you, we have options to, to send them around the country for better opportunities. Although now comfortably regarded as one of the best fast bowlers in the world, Kakiso Rabada has not forgotten where he comes from and has now given the young players coming behind him the opportunity to learn from the best players from all different walks of life and environments. For News from Africa, Channel 405, I am Yolu Goshe at the Wanderers Stadium in Johannesburg.